So let's have a quick look at the Grunge Factory add-on, which is an industrial kit bashing set by Griebeltown. Town. Very quickly, you can create this kind of like industrial sci-fi set. Now there's various forms in this. The way I use it, I normally use the scatter add-on, but let's go straight from scratch. Cause I want to show you quickly on how to do, like how to set it up. So shift A, search, mesh, plane, scale, five. I went 50. Uh, I'm gonna subdivide just to give the ground some extra geometry here. Let's press N to bring up the side panel and we're gonna go down into Geo Scatter. So once I've installed it at all, click on the plane to be my ground. Let's come over into Biome Scatter, open Biome Scatter. And this is obviously where I've got all my Polygony, my uh, B Production stuff. However, we're gonna focus on the Grunge Factory. So we've got various factories that we wanna select from. Let's go block five. We can close that now. And then you can see now how we've imported an industrial factory really super quick. If we go into render settings, and this is it in Eevee, let's quickly change that out to um, give it some environment. And like that, we've spawned an industrial space super quick, amazing. And I mean, technically, we can select this plane, open biomes, and we might throw in some grass, just for fun. With that, let's make the ground concrete. Ah, uh, not really. I'm just gonna make it a dark gray. Actually, I should probably actually make that a real color. But anyway, as you can see that that is looking pretty schmick and we've pretty much done no work. However, if we want a larger city, I'm actually gonna get rid of the grass so that my computer doesn't kill me. Select the floor plane, tab into edit mode, scale 10. And uh, yeah, now we've got like this massive industrial area. However, there are quite a few sets, uh, well, sorry, different blocks. So for instance, if I were to clear that one, open biomes, let's go into the grunge. Block seven is what I had in the open intro. So let's go block eight. And that is looking mighty glorious. Now, for instance, we wanted to create a bit of a road through. I can go tab into edit mode. Let's just select this whole area, create a vertex group. And we'll call this a road. Make sure we assign it. Then we come down to group culling mask, tick, tick that, bam. And so now it's kind of like we've got a road where we can throw a texture on and um, it's a bit too big, I reckon. Let's go something like that. It's like that and that, remove, assign, and there we go. <laughs> now if we want to add that little bit of extra stuff, let's go into the physical starlight add-on, sun. This would actually be a really good scene with a whole bunch of people or stuff walking through. That's schmick. That's a pretty good thumbnail.